God will give you a Hannah, hallelujah. Hannah was the wife of Elkanah. Elkanah had another wife, Peninnah. Peninnah had children for Elkanah, but Hannah was barren. And what did God do? God touched Hannah's womb and he blessed her with Samuel. Peninnah laughed and mocked and scorned Hannah so much that Hannah cried continually and could not eat. God gave Samuel to Hannah. Do you think for one minute that when Peninnah was laughing at Hannah and mocking her and scorning her, her children were not also doing the same? Oh, be careful, little children, what you do. Oh, be careful, little children, what you say. Be careful how you speak against a child of the living God. Samuel grew and became one of the greatest prophets to ever walk this earth. He was so special that he was the man who anointed the first king of Israel. Hannah was so happy that 1 Samuel chapter 2 contains a prayer that she wrote, a prayer of praise and thanksgiving. And I term this prayer, Hannah's Hallelujah. God will give you the victory, daughter of God. God will give you the victory, son of God. You will prevail and you will overcome every evil word that your enemies have spoken against you. Don't mind their laughter. Don't mind their mockery. God will give you the victory and you will have the last laugh. Glory be to God. Amen.